Clarence Lyndon Crabb II, commonly known by his stage name Buster Crabb, was an American competitive swimmer and movie actor. He won the 1932 Olympic gold medal for 400-meter freestyle swimming event before breaking into acting. He starred in a number of popular films in the 1930s and 1940s. He also played the title role in the serials Flash Gordon and Buck Rogers. Birth Crabb was born to Edward Clinton Simmons Crabb, a real estate broker, and Lucy Agnes Crabb, in Oakland, California. He had one brother, Edward Clinton Simmons Crabb, Jr., Hawaiian Olympics. Raised in Hawaii, Crabb graduated from the Punahou School in Honolulu. He competed in two Olympic Games as a swimmer. In 1928 he won the bronze medal for the 1,500 meters freestyle, and in 1932 he won the gold medal for the 400 meters freestyle when he beat Jean Taras of France by a tenth of a second. He attended the University of Southern California, where he was the school's first All-American swimmer and a 1931 NCAA freestyle tick list. He also became a member of the Sigma Chi fraternity before graduating from USC in 1931. In 1933 he married Ada Virginia Held and gave himself one year to make it as an actor. If he didn't, he would start law school at USC. Crabbe and his wife were the parents of two daughters, Sanday and Susan, and a son, Cullen. Sande died of apparent anorexia in 1957, after a long fast when she was 20. At the time of her death, she weighed only 60 pounds. Hollywood Crabbe's role in the 1933 Tarzan serial, Tarzan the Fearless, began a career in which he starred in more than 100 movies. In the 1933 King of the Jungle, 1941 Jungle Man, and the 1952 serial King of the Congo, he played typical Jungle Man roles. He starred in several popular films at this time, including The Sweetheart of Sigma Chi alongside Betty Grable in 1933 and Search for Beauty, and in 1936 he was Flash Gordon in the very successful Flash Gordon serial, followed by two sequels, released by Universal in 1938 and 1940. The series was shown later extensively on American television in the 1950s and 1960s, then edited for release on home video. He also portrayed a Western folk hero version of Billy the Kid, in 36 films, starred as Buck Rogers. In some movies he is credited as Larry Crabb or Larry Crabb. His sidekick in most of his westerns was actor Al Street, John. In 1939 Crabbe reunited with Betty Grable for a lead role in the mainstream comedy hit Million Dollar Legs. Crabbe is the only actor to play Tarzan, Flash Gordon, and Buck Rogers, the top three syndicated comic strip heroes of the 1930s. Crab starred at the Billy Rose as Aquacade at the New York World's Fair in its second year of 1940, replacing a fellow Olympic swimmer Johnny Vice Muller. Television Crab starred in the television series Captain Gallant of the Foreign Legion as Captain Michael Gallant. The adventure series aired on NBC. His real life son, Cullen Crab, appeared in this show as the character Cuffy Sanders. He was featured frequently in archival footage in the children's television program, The Gabby Hayes Show. Prior to his playing, Captain Michael Gallant Crabbe had hosted a local NYC-based children's film wraparound television series The Buster Crabbe Show. The series, which was set against the backdrop of a ranch foreman's bunkhouse featured Crabbe engaging his viewers in games, stories, craft-making. The Buster Crab Show was seen weekday evenings on WOR-TV in New York City from Monday, March 12, 1951, to Friday, October 3, 1952. The series returned to the NYC Airways on WJZ-TV on Monday, September 21, 1953, and was retitled Buster's Buddies. The WJZ TV version of the series included a studio audience of kids and became more of a kids' variety show. Despite the addition of the studio audience and Crab's personality, Buster's Buddies, 
was not a hit and it was cancelled on Friday, March 26, 1954. Crabbe made regular television appearances, including one on an episode of the 1979 series Buck Rogers in the 25th century in which he played a retired fighter pilot named Brigadier Gordon, in honor of Flash Gordon. When Rogers praises his flying, Gordon replies, I've been doing that sort of thing since before you were born. Rogers responds, you think so, a old-timer, to which Gordon replies, a young man, I know so. Crab had, in fact, been playing Buck Rogers since long before Gerard was born, later years and death. Crabbe's Hollywood career waned somewhat in the 1950s and 1960s. The ever-industrious Crabbe became a stockbroker and businessman during this period. According to David Ragan's movie Stars of the 30s, Crabbe owned a Southern California swimming pool building company in later years. In the mid-1950s, Crabbe purchased the Adirondack campus of the Adirondack Florida School, which advertised itself as a swim camp for youngsters aged 8 to 14. During this period of his life, Buster joined the swimming pool company Cascade Industries of Talmadge Road, Edison, New Jersey, in his capacity as vice president of sales. Promoter and spokesman for Cascade, the world's first packaged pool company, he attended shopping mall openings and fairgrounds combining promotion of his swim camps and Cascade vinyl liner in ground swimming pools. A pool line was named after him, and pools were sold by Buster Crab dealers throughout the eastern seaboard and southern states from 1952 until 1990. Though he followed other pursuits, he never stopped acting. However, his career in the 1950s and after was limited to lower-budget films, notably westerns such as Gunfighters of Abilene, Arizona Raiders and The Bounty Killer. He appeared as the father of a young swimmer in the comedy swim team and as a sheriff in the horror film Alien Dead followed by the feature film The Comeback Trail in 1982, one year before his death. Crabbe also appeared in television commercials for Hormel Chili, Icy Hot, and The Magic Mold Body Shirt, an upper body male girdle of sorts, which purportedly helped in weight loss. Through Icy Hot, he was actively involved in arthritis education. Despite his numerous film and television appearances, he is best remembered today as one of the original action heroes of 1930s and 1940s cinema. In the 1950s, two comic book series were published named after him. Eastern Color published 12 issues of Buster Crab comics from 1951 to 1953 followed by Love Gleason's The Amazing Adventures of Buster Crab for four issues in 1954. In 1965 he was induced into the International Swimming Hall of Fame. During his senior swimming career Crab set 16 world and 35 national records. He continued swimming through his 60s, and in 1971 set a world record in his age group. He died on April 23, 1983 of a heart attack after tripping over a wastebasket in his Scottsdale, Arizona home. He is interred at Green Acres Memorial Park in Scottsdale. Timeline 1908 Born as Clarence Lyndon Crabb in Oakland 1910 U.S. Census with the Crabs in California 1928 Olympics 1931 – Graduated from the University of Southern California 1932 – Olympics – Won gold medal in 400-meter freestyle 1933 – Played title role in Tarzan the Fearless 1936 – Played title role in Flash Gordon 1938 – Played title role in Flash Gordon's trip to Mars 1939 – Played title role in Buck Rogers 1940 – Played title role in Flash Gordon Conquers the Universe 1941 – Begins work with producers releasing corporation in a variety of westerns and jungle films 1955 – Start of Captain Gallant of the Foreign Legion 1957 – End of Captain Gallant of the Foreign Legion 1960-1983 – Sales VP and promoter of the Buster Crab range of Cascade Swimming Pools 
1980 guest starred in the Buck Rogers in the 25th Century episode, Planet of the Slave Girls, as an aged pilot named Brigadier Gordon, a tongue-in-cheek reference, and salute, to his Flash Gordon roles. 1983 died in Scottsdale, Arizona, aged 75.